Hey everyone, it's Brian. I want to make a little video uh, that's going to just tell you how to find uh, the information for eye observation. So when Ron sends you information about your observation, you know where to find it. So if you go to uh, if you go to a web browser, and if you just do a Google search for eye observation, you should come up with a couple of choices. Choose the login to eye observation system, login. And when you're there, you can log in using the information that Ron has provided you. So I'm going to log in briefly. And it's giving me a choice here. I need to log into the new system. And you can see I've already entered in my data. Once you've created uh, once you've entered the login, there are a couple things you should do. Uh, first thing I would suggest is to go to My Profile, and you can upload a, a pretty picture. Notice mine is just recently taken. Enter in your, or correct your information, and at this point you can create a password uh, that suits you. Down below, you can check or uncheck boxes that will... Um, determine when you get email notifications of communications. So for example here, uh, send the, a copy of the learner notification email to me when I finish an observation. Um, notify me when a new observation form has been assigned to me. These are things that are probably for, um, for our boss. But if you go down here, you'll see that there are things that you can be notified when discussions are happening. Um, when I've been added to a conference, things that will be really late, related to the observation process. To tell you the truth, I just went through and I clicked everything. That way I'm not going to miss anything and uh, um, I, I won't be out in the cold or wondering what's going on. Once you've done that, you click save and you're ready to go. So, by observation, go uh, to use the log information that uh, Ron has provided you and uh, you should be ready to go. Hope this helps.